So after everything that's happened, Elon Musk finally bought Twitter for a whopping $44 billion. Julian. Oh my, just had to take out a small loan there. And it's a place where the worst of human society lives. The spaceport, you will never find a more wretched hive of scum and villainy. We must be cautious. But it's still a fun place. And Elon Musk has already started changes within the company. He already announced that he has fired over 3,000 people. Damn. Damn. Apparently there was a lot of fat in Twitter and he had to trim it. He also fired human resources. That's interesting. It seems like one of his goals is he wants to bring free speech to Twitter, which I think that is an excellent idea. But, you know, Twitter mob probably won't like that too much. And here's my thoughts on Twitter Blue, the $8 a month subscription service. I actually think it's a really good idea. Seeing how they already had a Twitter Blue as well, this time he's going to change a few things about it. I think it's going to really help get rid of the bots by charging $8 a month, which will then turn put more real people on the site and hopefully more accurate information information because usually bots are not going to be like oh i gotta pay eight bucks for this so hopefully more real people more reliable information that's that's just how i see it so i think it's a good thing and plus you can still use twitter for free this is not required so this is just if you want some bonus stuff now i don't know what all is going to be with twitter blue I'll have to see. I, I heard there was a tweet where he announced some features, but I couldn't find it. So I don't exactly know what's coming to Twitter Blue. We'll have to see though, if it's worth that $8 a month. But it's interesting because he's gonna use this $8 a month for content creators, which I'll get to that in just a second. He's also adding an edit button to tweets. Thank goodness we've been needing this for a while now. You're goddamn right. I've been wanting to edit tweets for a long time. I think that should have been there from the beginning, but you know, why not? And also long form text. I cannot tell you how many times I've tried to do a tweet and, or had a conversation with someone and literally the tweet is full. Now he's gonna raise that. So that's gonna be very nice. And apparently his goal is he wants to use Twitter Blue for revenue for content creators. I think this is an excellent idea. So, and it sounds like that he's gonna give at least more than 55%, at least one of the tweets said, so. This is a really good idea. I think they should really focus on more content creators on Twitter, advertising more on Twitter, and then giving an income for the content creators gives more of a reason to go on there. And I think that's just gonna help YouTubers as well. I think this is actually a really smart idea. And I think this is a path he should go down, which I, I would love to see it. More money for content creators, yeah. It's funny ever since, you know, he's taking Twitter, Elon Musk's policies, they, they're actually pretty good. So, I mean, I don't know why everyone's complaining. Or should I say, there's a certain demographic of people complaining. I just feel like he's given more freedoms and way more stuff for creators. So I think this will be good. I can't wait to see how this is gonna affect gaming, especially with the revenue for content creators, all the gaming videos on there gaming advertisers because we already know that some advertisers are already pulling from twitter but there's also an increase in people coming to twitter as well since elon musk has purchased so this is this is a very unique situation here so the more people is really good advertisers leaving is very bad so he's definitely going to be making less money with this however though it will be very interesting to see if twitter blue is going to make up for that advertising revenue or if he's got some other plans here at play but hopefully this puts the gaming industry on a more positive path like i said i have a I have a feeling it's going to affect the gaming we'll just have to see how it affects the gaming industry though and now there's even accusations and they're finding evidence that apparently twitter twitter employees where basically um, some people were, um, they were offering a service for $15,000, they would give you a blue check mark. That's, that's insane. Um, there's some evidence with that. So I think we'll, we'll need the, I think we'll need more information about it. And I think we'll get more information about it as the week's going ahead. But I feel like Elon Musk is going to find a lot of corruption in Twitter. And I hope anyone on any side of the aisle realizes that twitter is very has a lot of corruption in it so it's gonna be interesting to see how much we're gonna find with this and now here comes my favorite part with elon musk buying twitter the favorite thing of all time has happened the twitter meltdown these are just some of the tweets i found that i thought were hilarious you're praising satan i think i'll switch to tiktok now a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Well, enjoy the TikTok thoughts. I'm just saying, you know, for a religious person, it looks like on your profile picture, you know, TikTok's not really a great improvement. Just saying. Musk spent 44 billion on Twitter, 
The world's population is 8 billion. He could have given each person 5 billion and still have money left over. I feel like a sheik for 5 billion would be life changing for most people, yet he wasted it all on Twitter. Okay, so here, as we can see, is the goalpost being moved every single time. No matter what you do, you know, there's always something better you could have done. I feel like Twitter was a good idea because I feel like he could really change culture there. And, you know, there's kind of problems with just giving everyone money. Just giving someone money doesn't solve problems. Again, it doesn't teach anyone anything. If anything, if you just literally gave people money just like that, literally the next coming years, the next generation, they won't know how to do anything. I mean, they won't learn any of this stuff. And then the people that even donate this amount of money and don't have as much as Elon Musk, I mean, usually they won't even donate enough to feed their families or anything. Like it only lasts for like a month. But even then, if you did like $5 billion over here, I mean, again, this doesn't teach them how to do anything. It's better to teach someone and to learn something than to just straight up give them money, okay? Anyway, but it's a new goalpost, he'll never win, so. This I thought was pretty funny too. You know, there was rumors that Twitter Blue was gonna be 20 bucks, but it turns out it's eight. And uh, I thought this was posted by Elon Musk and I thought it was pretty funny. So, you know, an $8 latte, that's all fine and handy, but you know, an $8 blue check mark. I just, I think that's hilarious. I mean, if you if you can afford latte, you can afford a blue check mark, just saying. Who knows, maybe that's a hot take. And I wanna leave you with a closing statement by Elon Musk. That is why I bought Twitter. I, di I didn't do it because it would be easy. I didn't do it to make more money. I did to try and help humanity, who I love. And I do so with humility, recognizing that failure and pursuing this goal despite our best efforts and a very real possibility. Oh my gosh, I probably butchered like 15 of those words. But anyway, I just thought that was really interesting. This doesn't really sound like the most evil man known to humankind as Twitter is going about. And I think it's also real funny how this is a green energy guy, but you know, electric cars, but you know, I just forget that. And that is gonna be it for this video. I just wanna thank all of you guys um, for watching this video. Thank you so much. Also, thank you for 100 subscribers. I would not be here today without you guys. And I just wanna let you all know as well, please like, subscribe, and share the video too. More views, the better. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you so much for watching my video. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and share the video. Also check out my other videos as well.